Hey YouTube, um, I just got a parcel, a oh, big box, my uh, Emac G4 just arrived, it's February 11th 2010, this is the 1 gigahertz model, I'm going to unbox it for you on video, but it was two 1 gigahertz models, one that uses PC100 RAM, has a Radeon 7500, and um, had USB 1.1, this one's the 1 gigahertz release to education only, with DDR RAM, um, a Radio 9200 and USB 2. I don't know if you can see on the top, but it's quite funny. I just read this too. Please do not drop me or drop things on me. I'm heavy, 29 kilograms, and fragile, and I contain a CRT screen. That was quite funny. Anyway, I'm going to unbox this on video for you. This is my best Mac that I've ever had so far, because at the moment all I've got is... I've had a uh, G4... I've had a PowerMac G4 tower, but this is the best Mac I own at the moment. A PowerBook G4 Titanium, which is in pretty bad shape. But uh, more on that in another video. Yeah, I'm going to unbox the Mac now. So, I'm quite excited. So, and I just got in, and guess what? The delivery company, because no one had been in, they left it across the road at someone else's house, so I've had to wait for them to come home for me to be able to fit this up. I got this for just £24.99 and the delivery was £15. I've got to let you know though, when I take it out, it is missing the uh, the drive door cover thing, the plastic thing with the apple on it, and it doesn't have a DVD drive at the moment. But I have a replacement drive cover in the mail coming. And um, that's it. Oh God. Check this out, open it and there's another box. Great. Oh wait, no, 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 it's not a box. Aha, it's a piece of cardboard. Let's drop that down there. Lots and lots of packing, what's this? Oh, just a bin bag with nothing important in it. A lot of bubble wrap. Uh, power cable, unfortunately it's not the original one. And, oh, there's an envelope. Here we are. It says on this note, Parts in envelope. Take apart guy on desktop. Please read before dismantling. You will need to jump on the new drive to CF. Cable select, not master or slave. Okay, so I've got envelope with parts in it and it's got... This should have a little plastic piece that... Yeah, there we go. That goes on the front of the eMac. This. And this, uh, the plastic thing with the Apple logo clips onto this. And then there's... A little ID cable because this thing hasn't got drive in it at the moment. I've also got a DVD ROM coming in the mail for this. So I'm going to unbox, unbox this heavy beast right now. So, yeah, 1 gigahertz with USB 2 and everything. Hell of a lot of. I don't know what's it called. Oh, uh, there's a lot of polystyrene. Oh, good gracious. Right, where's that knife gone? Oh, sorry about this, I'm just having to cut this false styrene apart to get the machine out. Well, how am I going to do this? Like, this thing weighs a ton. It's currently encased in bubble wrap, so... Ugh, more cardboard in there. Right, I don't know which way up this thing is, but so, there we go. I've lost the knife again now, because my room's covered in polystyrene. Oh, here we are. Oh, I can see the screen. Yes, that is a PS3. There's a PS3 back there. I'm using the PlayStation camera to record this. Oh, I've got it sideways. Hold on. Right, it's the right way up now. Oh, I can feel the, uh, the uh, CRT screen, the 70 inch CRT. Oh. 
Oh, 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 I'm in. Oh, I can see the mic and everything now. Might I add, this doesn't smell very nice. This has come from, I don't know, but... Oh, that's nice. Oh yeah, if you want to buy one of these, the seller on eBay hasn't got any 24.99 ones left that are missing. See, that's there's just a piece of black plastic in there that are missing the optical driver thing. But he's got some for 29.99 um, plus 15 pounds for delivery, and he's got some at 39.99 plus 15 pounds for delivery, which come with a CD-ROM drive. But all they have at the front is just that piece of plastic sat there, no cover, and those are. Uh, this, the name of the seller on eBay is Fat Freddy 2004. That's F A T F R E D D I E 2004. So you see, it's also missing the speaker covers, but as far as speaker covers go, I couldn't really care less. Well, it's in good nick. There's, there's a couple of scratches up the screen here. I don't know if you can really see that well. The speakers aren't damaged. This one's got a little nick on it, but I don't really care. That needs to come out and my DVD drive will go there. Ugh, it's a bit dusty around the side, but... The other side, we got audio, um, headphones, I think that's line in, three USB 2 ports, two Firewire 400s, an Ethernet and a mini VGA out, power button, power cord hole there. Right, well thanks for watching and I'll do a short review on this soon. As, and um, and I'll do an upgrading video as soon as I've received my DVD-ROM drive in the mail. I'm going to be upgrading this to Leopard. I'll show you how to disassemble it and um, upgrade your RAM, put your DVD drive in. Plus, you'll possibly see where the hard disk is as well, but I'm not upgrading that for a while because it's only 40 gig and I can, I've got an 80 gig SATA USB external which I'll be plugging into the USB 2 ports. So, yeah, it's a bit dusty, but nice machine. So I'll be back with that and how to fit all this and everything uh, soon, probably this weekend. Okay, thanks for watching my video. Bye.